Chick-fil-A. Good morning. Good morning. Where are we going, guys? To the Lagoon Fest in Lago Mar. Are y'all excited? Yes. yes. Woo! Show me y'all's excited dance. <laughs> <laughs> but first, we gotta stop at Chick Chicken Fillet. Yeah. <laughs> see, see you there. Okay, so we made it to Lagoon Fest at Lago Mar in Texas City. Before you enter, make sure you have everything you need because they won't let you go back out to your car to get anything you've forgotten. Um, once you're past check-in, they'll check your bags. And then there was a little area to the left that they sold floaties and they had complimentary life jackets for the kids in case you didn't bring one. They also had other things to buy too that helped. Sunglasses, hats phone cases, things like that, little toys for the kids in the water. We did rent a peninsula cabana. It was pretty neat. It gave us a space to relax under. The umbrella provided a lot of shade and it also came with these beach chairs to sunbathe in. So you're not allowed to bring any outside food or drinks inside, but they did have about six food trucks there. Um, there were a lot of good items on the menus. Um, I saw hot dogs, wings, tacos, pizza, barbecue, and one that offered like a snow cone type ish dessert. Um, but we just settled for pizza because I figured that would have been easier and faster for the kids to eat and enjoy. cousins in the kayak they were trying to get that going um, it was so much fun watching them and I can tell they had a lot of fun out there on the water there was also another side of the lagoon they had these swings and a lot of shallow areas so the kids can play in. So yeah. And I know I've said it before um, about recommending the cabanas, but I know Lagoon Fest is only until September 30th. Um, but if you do go, make sure you get a cabana or else the shade is first come first serve. Um, and you have to bring your own chair. And as you could see, it got full quick.
Here's your shot, cuz. So my sister, her husband, and my cousins got on the obstacle course at Lagoon Fest. It was so much fun watching them. Um, I can just imagine how much fun they had actually on it. I'll be posting a separate video about only the obstacle course. I didn't want this video to be too long, but if you're only here to see the obstacle course, I'll be sure to post the link of the video below. So I'm going to be leaving y'all with some photos that we took. Um, all in all, I had a good time. Um, there were sanitizing stations everywhere. The restrooms were phenomenal. Um, they did enforce masks when you walked around and were getting food. The only dislike I had was the sand. I feel like when you're getting ready to go, you get sand everywhere. So I feel like they could have done without that. But I guess it gives the place a nice look. And lastly, they do have a bar. So bring your ID if you're ready to drink that day. Um, and thank y'all for watching my channel. If you like this video, um, please subscribe. I was so happy to make these memories with my family, so we'll see what we have in store next.